the opposition bets on some unsuspecting customers in this local pub. The proposition bet suckers you in as it's a bet on an event or an outcome you believe can only go one way. And it always does go one way. The hustler's way. So watch and learn. It's Paul's turn to get in the round, and that means picking targets for a proposition bet that Paul thinks he is sure of winning. This one is straightforward geometry. No sleight of hand or other trickery involved. This bet is for beer. Here's the bet. What's the longest? The height from here to here, or the rim of the glass from here to here? So what's the longest? The circumference or the height? It seems a bit close to call, but the three friends warily plump for the height being a greater distance than the circumference. You go for the height. Yeah. Paul ratches up the bet. For two beers, it's the combined height of the beer glass and an ashtray versus the distance around the rim. Now all the way. Now, now the height of it. The height has to be better. Has, has to that's be two better. drinks. So if I can prove that that's greater than that. I have to prove it. They're sticking with the height as it seems a sure effect. Go on then. Paul won't let it rest there and seems to have got caught up in the game as he raises the stakes yet again. To three beers and three shots, with the height now made up of the beer glass, Paul's mobile phone, an ashtray and a box of matches. <laughs> so, three beers and three shots, if I can prove to you that that is bigger than that. Paul seems to have lost the plot and stacks up another ashtray making the combined hut out of two ashtrays a mobile phone, a box of matches and a beer glass. Paul's prize, if the three friends are wrong about the height being the longer dimension, will be three beers, three shots and three bags of crisps. Has, has to be bigger. Has to be bigger. Three beers, three shots, three bags of crisps. For the three friends, it's a surefire bet that the height is greater than the circumference. So, it's time for Paul to prove otherwise with the end of a paper napkin. And remember, there's no trickery here. Exactly. Make sure I don't cheat. I'll get it nice and tight. Mark exactly the point where it means. This is all above board. This bet is based on geometry, and even Paul can make a mistake in his calculations. No way. Now that is... Oh my God. <laughs> so, it wasn't the height that was the longest. It was the distance around the rim of the glass. Three beers, three shots, <laughs> three bags of crisps. Vindaloo, yes. Paul calls in his winnings. <laughs> For the mathematically minded, a standard beer glass is 15 centimetres tall, and the distance around the rim is a whopping 27 and a half centimetres. All you have to do to win this bet is to remember to keep your pile stacked to less than twice the height of the beer glass. 